In the next slide, we will see what happens when the former governor of California has memories uploaded into his brain. <laughs> this is the former governor of California having the memories of being married to Sharon Stone uploaded into his memories. Believe it or not, we can do this now on a small scale. At Wake Forest University, North Carolina, and also on, at USC in Los Angeles, animal memories, memories of mice, have actually been uploaded into mice. At Wake Forest University, they took a mouse, trained the mouse to sip water. They put two electrodes in the hippocampus on the upper left, shown here on the upper left, and recorded, like a tape recorder, the impulses that ricocheted through the hippocampus. Then the mouse forgot how to do this a while later. Then they reinserted that tape recording back into the hippocampus and bingo, the mouse learned on the first try. This is the world's first successful attempt to record a memory and upload that memory back into the brain of a mouse. Next will come primates. That's the next step. A primate, for example, may eat a banana and will record that memory and reinsert the memory perhaps into another monkey. And what's the short-term goal? A brain pacemaker for Alzheimer's patients. We want to take Alzheimer's patients and hook them up to a button they push the button and whoom, they know who they are, where they live, because we don't want millions of people with Alzheimer's walking the streets, wondering where they live. And beyond that, who knows, maybe one day you'll be able to push a button and learn the calculus course that you can never learn in the past.